Algebra 2 cram, New York State Algebra 2 regions. But no worries, this is a common core cram session. That means it's not limited to New York State. It can be used for any Algebra 2 course throughout the United States, as well as any Algebra 2 course throughout the world. Okay, so thanks for all the support from Florida, California, Canada, the UK, Jamaica. I definitely see you. Functions. Question nine, identify a one-to-one -one function. The odds of someone doing exactly what you tell them to do is slim, but I guarantee that if you cram with me, you'll become an Algebra 2 master. So inbox me at memedicine at gmail.com because I want to stick you with a syringe containing a healthy dose of eye-opening awareness of your inner mathematical genius. Definitely spread the word to your friends, classmates, peers, or even colleagues who are taking Algebra 2 with you as well. Tell them to inbox me at memedicine at gmail.com so that they too can order and purchase the complete Algebra 2 cram session. Let's delve into the question nine, one-to-one -one function. Which diagram represents a one-to-one -one function? Is it one, graphical plot one, two, graphical plot two, three, graphical plot three, or four, graphical plot four? Definitely press pause if you need to, and I'll give you a moment to think. Okay, so in a function, each input x value is associated with or belongs to only one output y value, okay? Graphically, that means that a vertical line is going to intersect the graph of the function at most once, no more than one time. So this criteria basically eliminates answer choice one. It's not even an actual function, let alone a one-to-one -one function, okay? Because in order to be one-to-one, -one, you actually have to be a function. All right, and in a one-to-one -one function, um, each y value is going to be associated with, or is the result of, or you could even say comes from, only one y x value okay, input into the function equation. So graphically, this means that any horizontal line will intersect the graph of a one-to-one -one function at most one time, so only one time. That means this is going to eliminate answer choice two as well as answer choice four, okay? These are functions. That means they pass the vertical line test but they're just not one-to-one -one functions. They fail the horizontal line test because their y values have more than one um, associated x value or input independent variable. This means that the correct choice is going to be answer choice three. It's both a function according to the vertical line test and it's a one-to-one -one function because it passed the horizontal line test. All right, okay.